like Lawrence. I am originally from South Florida. You know, my mom was a stand-up comedian also, so I think that's where I learned a lot. My first stand-up comedy show, I, I saw her perform at a steak restaurant when I was 13 years old, and the guy that went on right after her was like one of my substitute teachers. So I never got to see this as glamorous. <laughs> I think the moment that I thought that stand-up could be something that I could do was my seventh year of being a slam poet and making no money in it. Be like, he is the man behind the machine. If you know what I mean, he destroys my self-esteem. I literally thought that I was going to buy a house with that. <laughs> Yeah, my style of comedy is acerbic. It's um, self-deprecation, you know? If the audience can hate me as much as I have all my life in 10 minutes, then I feel like I've really done something incredible. Give it up, everybody, for Mike Lawrence. Mike Lawrence, everyone. Oh, man, how's it going, everybody? <laughs> Literally, as I was walking up here, a guy just goes, dude, you're sick. And I'm like, as a nerd, it's like, I'm glad I get to entertain my oppressors now. Uh, <laughs> thanks for beating me up in high school and turning me into the comic I am now. Uh, <laughs> I am uh, married. Uh, I know that uh, I am not in my wife's league whenever people meet us. No one ever goes, oh, so how'd you meet her? They always just go, so how did you find her? And it's like, what am I supposed to say to that? She was in a basement with her sisters, and I picked the youngest one. <laughs> She's very uh, politically active uh, in this election season. Who's excited about the elections, everybody? And that's why we're in the problems we are. Um, <laughs> we did this to ourselves. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, the most exciting race is uh, Beto O'Rourke versus Ted Cruz. Um, it's just tough for me because I believe in Beto's politics more, but I also always feel like I have to root for the ugly guy against the pretty boy. <laughs> like, <laughs> but I want Beto to win. But Ted Cruz, let's just talk about how punchable his face is. <laughs> for a second. <laughs> Ted Cruz looks like the guy who smelled a fart, but it's clearly the one who's also farting. Like, <laughs> it looks like if Mrs. Doubtfire put man makeup on top of the Mrs. Doubtfire makeup. 